Okay, right now we are at the Dollar Tree and we are going to try to make you $20 make a challenge. Everything here is so, like, not my color, like, the colors that I won't ever go for. So these are the colors. Oh, everything they got here. And you go, can see that here, but look. I think this is gonna be my bronzer. I know it's butter, face butter, but they don't have bronzers here, so I guess I'm gonna have to use that as contour and bronzer. And about the lipsticks, they do have a variety of lipsticks. I kind of like this kind. I have already the lip gloss and the lipstick on. I I'm, good thing I don't wear lip liner and I, I'm gonna get one of these it's the only color they have because the other are too dark this oh my goodness I wanna wear it's liquid makeup so I guess it's kind of like foundation because this is the concealer so I think I'm gonna be using this one okay. so that's what I'm gonna get Let's see how much it is. I hope it's under 20. Hello you doll, this is me Princess Alexa and today I'm back with a new video. Today we're gonna be doing the uh, $20 makeup challenge and I only have $20 bill. This is what I bought at Dollar Tree, I believe is kind of like a lot. But guess what? Everything was $16 plus taxes, so $16.95, so almost $17. We did pretty, pretty, pretty good. Excuse my face and the redness and the blemishes and all that. Because I don't know what's going on. My body is like going through something. <laughs> Who knows what it is. I'm just breaking out. I guess my breakout is having a breakdown. <laughs> so I got quite a few. Like a lot of things. Like a lot. Okay, Who gonna need these pigments when I bought eyeshadows? They don't, have, they don't sell primers. They don't sell uh, contour kits. This is all I could find, so I'm gonna show it to you, and we're gonna go ahead and get started with the video. But I just wanted to show you those what I got. So I got these two powders. These are LA Cosmetics, and these are gonna be using as a bronzer. This one as a powder. This was the concealer. This is the concealer, and this is the foundation. I found this brow product blush. That's, this is the lighter they have. Also, I got these, um, like a sparkly glitter. Yes, I guess it's a glitter topper or eyeshadow topper. So, I got these two eyeliner. This is a liquid eyeliner, this is a pencil eyeliner for the eyes. I got mascara, it's a wet and wild. I got this lipstick. I don't know which one I'm gonna be using, but Yes, I got these lipsticks. Use the weather has been today awful, like all day rainy, so it's kind of like super dark outside. So that's why I got like a bunch of lights now. But anyway, and also I got these three pigments. Like apparently I do <laughs> need them. But since they don't sell any highlighter, I think I'm going to be using one as highlighter. I'm going to decide which one it is for a highlighter and this is the eyeshadow palette that they I think I found it interesting that they have a different variation of colors metallics and mattes I don't know how, how it's gonna perform but we'll see okay without further ado let's just get started so they don't have like beauty blenders and stuff like that there so I'm gonna use my own you know I don't prime my face you know normally I use that uh, splash because I put moisturizer at night when I go to bed 
or whenever I wash my face, I put the moisturizer so I'm used to it. Like uh, right now, I don't have anything, nothing. But I'm gonna try, I guess, this by itself. So this is the LA Liquid Makeup Foundation. It says that it's new, so we'll see. Sounds like in this palm kind of thing. Oh, wow. Ooh, oh my God, this is not my color. <laughs> This is the color they have, like the darkest tan. <laughs> this is no tan. This is super light. Maybe we can make it work. I'm gonna put some more. Maybe the, the sponge absorb it all. I don't know because let's see if it takes my redness. I hope it doesn't break me out more than I am. <laughs> This is crazy, Which I don't know if it's something that I'm eating or my hormones are just crazy. But I'm getting breakouts every freaking day. I don't get it. So this is kind of like super cheer. I don't know if we can build it up. Let's try it one more time. Oh my god, because I don't know if you can call. I know I'm going to look like a ghost. It feels weird though. It feels super tacky. It's just weird. It's not covering anything. <laughs> nope. I don't know what this is. It's not building up either. So. <sighs> well. What do you expect for a dollar? Let's try the concealer. And the concealer is this LA Colors. What? <laughs> this is even darker than the foundation. <laughs> oh my god. And it's also sheer, so. And this one is like, you're supposed to put a little bit, but with this one, ah, uh -uh, it's not working. Or my red spot here. Doesn't even go in my red spot here. Look. That is insane. <laughs> so what is this water with a little bit of color? Oh no. Oh no. It's coming off. Let's move on to powder. So I do have these two powders. I, I bought one supposed to be for contour and the other is supposed to be for powder. So this is kind of pinkish. I don't know which one is going to work for me. I'm going to get this brush. I don't know if it looks like too pink. Oh. It does have a mirror but it's so tiny. They also like better than nothing, right? <laughs> Oh wow. <laughs> they didn't have any like lighter tones. Cause I would have like kinda like white kind of translucent if they had it. But they everything is like medium to dark. It's supposed to be natural beige. <laughs> this is not coding anything. Let's try with the beauty blender. I don't think it's picking up anything. Can you all see this? It look better with the sponge, which is damped, the beauty blender. You just gotta keep building it up. Like if you want like some color here. Okay, so that's that. And now I'm gonna be using this as contour, <laughs> which I don't know if it's gonna be good. To be honest, so we're gonna get a contour brush. Contour. Let's see if it does. This. this is from Wet n Wild, so I will list all the names down in the description. But this is a color tan. It's supposed to be tan, but it's not tanning. Wow, you guys, I don't see any difference. 
you. Wow, I look like I'm covered in powder. That is crazy. I'm gonna control my nose. Try to. Okay, so moving on to brows. I got this one. It brings like two shades of colors. I don't know, we'll see which one. It kind of looks like eyeshadows. I'm gonna get the darkest one and I get the, it, it brings a little tiny brush I'm gonna be using. We'll see how it performs. Oh wow, isn't it too dark? Probably. Let's try the lighter one. Yeah, the lighter I think it is better. It's very powdery. And this is with the lightest one. See, this is not that bad, but it's still dark. <laughs> I don't know what color is this. This is um, medium brown. Okay, so moving on to blush. I got this. Mauve Aldous brings a little brush which I'm not gonna be using. I'm gonna be using this one. Hmm. I was expecting it to be super dark, but it's not. I love me some blush, and I don't know. Is it building up? Maybe. Now for eyeshadows, I got these LA Makeup. They say I love makeup. Pocket eyeshadow palette. It doesn't have like any specific color. I guess it's on the nude, dark, earthy colors. Let's do swatches. I can't believe I put my finger in there. They are not that bad. Oh yes, only the metallics one are the, the kind of good. So those are the first four. I don't know if you guys can see. They are very similar. So these are the colors with a wet brush. And here in the sunlight. And also on my tender skin. <laughs> because I just got that there, so I want to do that. But it looks so pretty, look at the metallics though, they are gorgeous. And the nudes too, very, very pretty. It brings 15 eyeshadows and they are like miniature. <laughs> but I still you got a variety of colors. My lid is gonna oily, I, I don't know if I should wear, cause that concealer is like nothing. Maybe if I put a little bit there. I'm gonna try by this color, it's kinda like a creamy color. And I'm gonna put this all over the lid. Wow, it looks white. It looks creamy on the pan, but it's actually like white. Hmm. Now I'm gonna be using this, it's kinda like for a transition color with the same brush. I'm gonna place it over the crease area. So, and now I'm gonna get this one. It's kind of like a taupe kind of color and I'm gonna place it all over the crease again. It's not showing. A little bit. I don't know if you can tell. Yep, it's not showing. Let's get a darker shade. So I'm gonna be using this darker over here. And I'm going to be placing it all over the crease again. Okay, now this one, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to use a, a pointy brush and I'm going to get, I don't know if to use this one or this one. So I think I'm going to be using, it's kind of like a purplish color. So I'm going to put it on the outer B. It looks black. 
when I swatch it also look like black it's supposed to be like a dark purple so I'm gonna get the black and add bring it inside over here now going back with the top color I'm gonna place it all again to blend this black with that one okay so we can try the shimmer color I think I'm gonna go for this one over here I want to use my finger because it's, it's the one in the second so I'm gonna place it like over here in the inner part towards the middle and then I'm gonna be using I think I'm gonna use this one in the corner over here let's see so I can put my finger that well but it's darker it looks pretty see rose gold kind of color it's pretty very pretty it's not as rose gold I don't know how to describe it it's like a rose gold copper <laughs> meets it's pretty and now I'm gonna be using because I got this glitter topper. I have one. I bought one before at Walmart, and it cost me way more than one dollar. So I don't know. Let's just try this one. Is let's do a swatch first. Over here. Oh wow, that's pretty. I'm gonna top this using my finger. On top of that copper. You beautiful color that we just placed that is pretty and just by tapping on it like that or lover you lead like that okay so i want to do the other side and then we'll move on to eyeliner i'm gonna say that these eyeshadows what is the metallics if you see they are very creamy there is no fallout so i use my finger though you see how pigmented it is to be one dollar eyeshadow is unbelievable like you don't have to use much you know and that's without feet splats you know or anything okay so let's move on to the brow bone i'm gonna going towards this goldy shade just because I, I i don't know i just feel like it will be better oh yeah that's pretty can you see this is not even with a wet brush it's dry any look at how oh my god you see let's put some in the inner corner Wow, that's crazy. Can you, are you all seeing what I'm seeing? <laughs> oh, this is insane. I like it. I don't like the mattes because you can not see it, but the metallics on this eye palette, definitely. Okay, now I'm gonna do my nose with the same color. And with the same brush. I wish I could have used it as highlighter for my entire face. Because it's tiny so I cannot put my brush in there. So what I'm going to do is one of these three. Let's try all. I'm going to try this one first which is um, in the color Honeysuckle. Then I'm going to put some over here. These are pigments. I don't know. You could have used it. You know, I gotta use it for my eyeshadows, but I don't want to use it for my eyeshadows. It's gonna be used for. Oh, I put a lot. Oh, <laughs> what? Oh my god! <laughs> Tell me this is not a good highlighter. <laughs> I believe it's the most blinding. Oh wow, I think I put a little too much. So I don't believe this white gonna be deep. This has like already that white cast. 
I'm just gonna be using the golden kind of to see if how it performs. Let's use the gold. They have some kind of like glittery shimmery. Okay, let's oh wow. <laughs> and now I feel that this is too gold. Should we try white? Why not? I can do swatches of these. Um, let's do this is the gold one, which is very pretty. That is the one I just put on. This is the one I put previously. Oops, and it's let's put it over here with the brush, it's not even with my finger. So, the white one. So the white one is like glitter. Let's see if I can put some on top. So about the hot mess here. My looks wet. <laughs> that definitely can be used as a highlighter. Definitely. Look at that blinding, that blinding moment. So moving on, we're gonna start. I don't know if I want to line my waterline. Maybe I maybe I can. Oh wow, this is like nothing. It's supposed to be like black, 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 but you can barely see it. It's not that bad, but I like darker, way darker than this. So I'm going back. This purple is supposed to be purple eyeshadow. I'm gonna place it down over here, close to the lash line. Since it looks black, we're gonna kind of like blend it with other, with the taupey color that we used. I'm gonna use this kind of brush, and I'm gonna be using the taupe color that I used earlier. And I'm just gonna kind of like soften the black which is not black but for some crazy loose black is like purple okay now we're gonna be using this um liquid eyeliner and i guess it's in the color super black <laughs> i like all the super black colors a fine tip which i love this is the kind of eyeliner that's what I, when i saw it because they do have the other tip because it's, it's gonna easier to do your eyeliner i guess it's not that bad i do know i have lashes i think i didn't see any lashes there and so i don't want to be using lashes because i didn't find one so i don't want to cheat you know like putting lashes that is not in this challenge it kind of takes a little while to dry, so I'm going to wait until it dries, and then I'm going with mascara. But right now, I do have these two lipsticks, which I don't know. I think this will match better. This is kind of lighter. Let's see. I'm going to do a swatch. But this skin is like a double like lipstick, and um, oh, this is definitely pink. This won't go with this makeup look. And this one. Mm. Smell of vanilla. I <laughs> put it on my nose. It smells like vanilla. Oh, this is like a balm. I think I'm going to be using this. It smells really good. This is in the color Mauve Glaze. kind of like a little dry it's supposed to be moisturizing I don't know it feels dry on the lips but I like the color then so the lips are done I don't know if I want to top it because this pink brought this kind of um, lip gloss and it's in the color twinkle it looks so pretty she goes I'm gonna try it because I have to try it Oh wow. Mm, smell like bubble gum. I wanna eat it. 
Wow. You can barely see it, but it's there. Let's just add some more. Oh, wow, it smells so good. I kind of like just lip gloss topper. I mean, it doesn't, it has a sparkle so that I can barely see them. And also it's like too tiny, so I have to go back and forth, you know, because it's too tiny. All right, so moving on to lashes. I got this Wet n Wild Mega Wear mascara and let's oh oh okay let's see how this looks like i'm very picky when it comes to mascaras i don't use any kind my favorite are my favorite has always been l'oreal mascaras but lately i've been into maybelline but it's not that bad but it's not that good either. I like to full her eyelashes. Can barely see it. Okay, you guys, so this is it. And this is my full face of $20 makeup challenge with Dollar Tree makeup, which was under $20. And this is how it looks like. It's not that bad. But it's not as good either. So overall, I think I like the pigments. I think this is like a super good buy. And what else I like about these? I don't know if I like the eyeliner. It's, it's very shiny and it takes like a years to dry. I love the lip gloss and the lip... Um, the lip color though is gorgeous very pretty the eyebrows are not that bad but i want to use it like that i will use my pencil and then the that which is not that bad as i said and the eyeshadows are not as bad either the blush is not as bad either so so what you don't think i feel like it's a sticky and i believe it's this thing it's supposed to be a topper, I think. Alright, you also, I hope you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment below, you know, what do you think about this makeup? So what I proud of have you tried before at the dollar store? And I want to know, leave it in the comments below. Give it a thumbs up too, to this video. Sorry about these swatches. God bless you all. See you on my next one. Bye-bye. If you can afford makeup or anything, yes. Don't actually got you though. I don't know, be a shimmer. <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to move this brush because I don't need it.